Yo, I'm upstairs at the Yo-Yo Factory headquarters. Yo-Yo Club is going on downstairs, and nobody knows it, but I have a little challenge for everyone. Let's go see who's here. Yo! Are you guys ready for a Yo-Yo battle right now? Wait, there's a Yo-Yo battle? Here's how this is gonna work. We have the Yo-Yo Factory bimetal. Everyone is going to do their best trick with the yo-yo. Doesn't matter how difficult the trick is, how crazy it is, it just has to be your best. Two attempts to complete your best trick and the winner gets to keep the yo-yo. The yo-yo used in this video is the new Yo-Yo Factory Bimetal, which is a super high performance, budget-friendly Bimetal yo-yo at only $60. But right now, through April 18th, you can get it for only $35 on my website, gentrystein.com, at the link in the description. First up was Chris, who's only been yo-yoing for eight months. As you can see, it's some absolutely crazy skills for that short amount of time frame. He busted out some sweet slack tricks and made it look good. Next was James, who threw down a quick but impressive horizontal trick. Then there's Connor, who's been in the yo-yo scene for a while. He just moved to Arizona to attend ASU. As you can see, he's got some sweet slack tricks, made everything look good, definitely a solid trick. Then we have Colin, who's also been in the yo-yo scene for a while. He threw down some sweet slack tricks with a couple technical elements and a few cross our moves to finish the trick off, the dude made it look good. Next up was Hunter, Yo-Yo Factory team member, multiple time world Yo-Yo contest finalist and Arizona State champion. Had some crazy difficult tricks here, exactly what you'd expect from this dude. Then we have Chance, the owner of Yo-Yo Factory, Johans' son, threw down a cool gyro trick here. Then Keith from Yo-Yo Factory hit some sweet slacks. If you don't know Keith, he does a lot of the shipping for Yo-Yo Factory. Next up, Isaias, he's only been yo-yoing for two months and hit a slack trapeze. Then we had Job, this was his first day of yo-yoing. He came into Yo-Yo Factory to hang out. It took a little bit of convincing to get him to join the battle, but eventually he said okay and he threw down this sweet trick. Let's see the trick, Job. Everyone at the club agreed we had a champion for the day.